Even though he's home for the off season, there are no off days for Antonio Johnson. And I come back home every year just to uh, get that sense of uh, humbleness. And uh, just, you know, this is where it all started. Here in Leland, where he was born and raised. It was a long journey for me and my family, you know, and um, I just made the best of it. And I'm blessed. Blessed because after dropping out of school here at Leland High, he wasn't too sure what his future would hold. So he earned his GED, which opened the door for him to attend Mississippi Delta Community College, where he became an All-American and soon after starred at Mississippi State. Then in 2007 came the peak of his journey, taken in the fifth round of the NFL draft by the Tennessee Titans. Like being from a small town, you know, uh, majority of the times people be like the odds are against you, you know, and um, you just have to, you know, um, fight through those obstacles that's um, thrown in your way, man, and take it on as a challenge, you know, and um, challenge yourself and, um, you know, go out and, and do the best you can, man, with, with whatever your uh, cause you dealt. And um, that's what I've done, you know, over the years. I've taken adversity and um, turned a negative to a positive. Set to begin his eighth year in the league, Antonio says he feels stronger and better than ever, but. I've been thinking uh, about life out of football. I know it don't last forever. Football is just a part of my life. It's not my life. And um, after football, you know, I got a few things I want to do, you know, become, you know, more of an entrepreneur and things of that nature. Um, probably do a little voluntary coaching here and there, but um, like I say, Football is a part of life, not my life. 